countries in South America and one in Central America in recent democratic elections have voted in the president who ran on an anti-corporatocracy ticket, anti-exploitation. These are not anti-American presidents. They, they often quote our Declaration of Independence. They love our ideals, but they, they run on tickets that say no more exploitation by foreign companies. Ecuador's oil must profit Ecuador's people. Bolivia's gas must profit Bolivia's people. They are really lighting the way for us. I think you know, they're teaching us about democracy. Uh, and some of the things that are going on in Africa, in the Middle East, in Asia, are also lighting the way. Um, so the world is showing us and sending us some very strong messages. But the fact of the matter is we are in a very influential position. You know, we do consume 25% of the world's resources and create over 30% of the world's pollution, 5% of the world's population. That puts us in a position to really set a new example, to establish a new model. And so I think we need to move forward and do that, listen to the rest of the world, watch what they're doing, but we need very hard here to set that example. The world does follow us. They watch our television, they watch our movies, they read our books, they want to be like us, many, many of them. And so we need to show them a new side of us, a side of us that really believes in sustainability and stability and peacefulness around the world. And if we do that, I think the rest of the world will, will help us and will follow with us and will also continue to help us in that process. Thanks. Thanks.